My issue with niacinamide has nothing to do with niacinamide itself, but how brands are marketing it today to all of you. Before we get into it, it's actually a powerhouse ingredient. It is a great ingredient, it's a vitamin B3 derivative that helps not only keratin production, restoring your lipid barrier, reducing inflammation, helping to minimize oil production or actually regulate it, and finally, it evens out pigmentation. So for all of those with melasma, it might be a good one for you. So what's the issue? More is not more, is not more, is not more, is not more, is not more. This is where less is more. The sweet spot of niacinamide is really between two to five percent. Whitney agrees. And so in order to actually get the most benefit of niacinamide, you want to be between three to five percent. Anything more than that is just going to inflame you, break you out of the process and make you miserable. So you're losing your money and your dreams.